There he is. Nice to meet you, mate. Nice to meet you, man. I just realized I never told you my name. No, it's all good. <laughs> hey, man, pop number 10, please. I think. <laughs> it's the best way to do it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> awesome. All right, safe riding. Yo, what is up, guys? Today, we're on a ride with a uh, brand new TikTok friend we've made, Drew. The weather is beautiful, the vibes are good. We're out here riding with some new mates. There's no better time to talk about how decent TikTok and social media actually can be for the motorcycling community. Now, I know in my last video, I blasted some of the occurrences that take place in TikTok and the motorcycle community. <laughs> but it's just one part of TikTok. Uh, not everything is so negative. So today I thought I'd talk about one of the coolest parts about being part of the motorcycle community and being on social media platforms such as YouTube and TikTok. And that's networking. I mean, it sounds like a pretentious term, but networking is just another way of saying making friends. And that's what we're out here doing. I've actually met a few people off YouTube and TikTok uh, over the duration of my riding journey so far, and it's been great. Uh, when I go out on these rides, I want to go out with people who uh, I can kind of tell will ride <laughs> responsibly, especially the first few times we meet, you know, it's... Uh, I enjoy my spirited riding, but I kind of do that solo or when I'm with people I know and trust. Let's see if we can get some Harley nods. Ah, oh, not a single nod! <laughs> Classic. Not that I expected one, to be honest. What a beautiful day to be stuck behind an Astra. How great. Yeah, so Drew saw that he lived in a similar area to myself and shot me a TikTok message and now here we are. Keen to go on this ride with him uh, and we're going to stop for some drinks at the top up in Emerald. Have a chat, get to know each other talk about bikes and such as you do with your biking buddies and then ride back down again and this all came to be because of uh, TikTok same thing occurred through YouTube Sean he uh, sent me a message well he, he commented on my videos and from there he was like you know try ride my bike if you want so we swapped bikes and that was amazing these curves are so nice but the problem is the speed limit so low around here can't really do anything too exciting I don't know why my dad went in front. He's the slowest rider out of all of us. The good thing about my dad being out in front though is it's going to stop me from doing anything too stupid. Uh, and you know what? That's not the worst thing in the world, is it? Yes, yeah, so one guy in my entire high school friend group who's into it and uh, he's, a, he's a busy man. So I kind of needed to, to find riding buddies on my own. I love how positive my experience has been with the motorcycling community, uh, especially through social media platforms like TikTok and YouTube. I've just met some awesome people and we're out here having good fun on our motorcycles through our love of two wheels, a shared passion. Hey, we got a nod. The concept of bonding through things you love, it's just, yeah. I actually got invited to back to my old high school to deliver a, a speech about careers and all of that boring stuff. And I decided to just talk about passion and how important it is to find the stuff you love and follow it as best as you can. Uh, and not necessarily in a career capacity, but as a hobby too. You don't have to make money off it. Uh, and in that, in that presentation, I actually touched upon how satisfying it is to share these things with other people who also love those passions and those hobbies. TikTok and YouTube allow me to do that uh, when I don't have many friends in my other circles who are into to motorcycles and the two-wheel lifestyle. Anyway, we're here in the beautiful little town of Emerald. Let's park up and find ourselves a nice drink. Gang, everyone's out today. It's so good. Take one, three, two, one. Hey guys, if you enjoyed watching the video, Wait, slow it down a little. No, I talk fast. 
Hey guys, if you're enjoying my content and you would like to buy me a drink, please shoot me a recommendation in the link below. I love riding motorcycles. Um, I know how to ride motorcycles for sure. My first shout didn't leave a recommendation, so I've opted for a Jetty Road Brewery Pale Ale. Cheers, Mum. Oh, that goes down nicely. So there you have it, folks. Uh, TikTok, YouTube, other social medias, they are all doom and gloom for the motorcycling community. Uh, you know, the, the last video I posted focused on a very singular negative aspect that I wouldn't say is representative at all of the entire community. This is the stuff that's uh, a little more common, and this is the stuff that we should be focusing on. Thanks for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, remember to like, comment and subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll catch you on the next one. You say you've got the guns, but I've never seen you bang, you say you've got